みなさんこんにちはバーチャルティーンアニメデーへようこそ I'm Japana Anna Aito Anna from Japan So you can call me Japana Thank you for attending my Creative Zen Session in Teen Anime Day. It's in the middle of a pandemic, but I really appreciate your positivity to attend the event. Is everything okay with you? Do you have any frustration, anger, Sadness, or do you have any stress or anxiety? If your answer is yes, you are human. You are not AI. You are not artificial intelligence. You are not robot. We Human beings have different kinds of feelings. Happy feeling, joyful feeling, also stressful feeling and angry feelings. It's very natural. However, negative feelings should be released in a harmless way. If you keep negative feelings, frustration, stress, anger inside of you, someday it will explode like volcano. So you have to release negative feelings in a harmless way. Harmless. That's the point. You cannot put your frustration or stress on somebody else. Yelling out or abusing or bullying. That's not the way to release your stress. In order to release your stress and create peace in your soul. The first activity today is Shin Kokyu. Shin Kokyu. The first letter Shin means deep. Kokyu means Breath. Shinkoku means deep breath. Very simple activity. However, it will help to relieve stress, frustration, and keep ourselves calm down and make peace. In your soul. Breathe in through nose two seconds. Breathe out through mouth four seconds. Let's try. You can stand up or you can sit down. As long as you keep your backbone, spine straight. Now, instead of counting one, two, one, two, three, four, instead of counting 
numbers in your head. I want you to say in your mind deep two seconds while breathing in and peace four seconds while breathing out. Say these words in your mind instead of counting numbers in your head. Okay? Deep peace. Let's try. Deep peace. You don't have to say verbally, just say in your mind, instead of counting numbers, much better. Please repeat this five times. Two second breathe in, four second breathe out. Total only six second. And five times. Six times five. Thirty second. One set only takes thirty second. You don't have to sit down ten minutes for meditation. Right? Just two second in, four second out. Repeat five times. But if possible, I want you to do this breathing activity, deep peace, at least three times a day, in the morning and daytime and before going to bed. Also, whenever you need to calm yourself down in stressful situation, just you can try this deep peace breathing. It will help you. By the way, I'm a first generation immigrant from the Far East Asia. I have a different appearance, different language, different accent and different culture. Some people don't like the difference and bullied me a lot, discriminated against me a lot, treated me very unfairly. I was so depressed, but I survived because I found out that being bullied by mean people doesn't mean I'm a bad person. Being bullied by mean people doesn't mean I'm worthless. It's not my fault, right? People who bully other people, they are mean people. So after I found out that, I stopped hating myself. I started loving myself again. I started loving my core again. So my soul didn't die. I could survive. So just I want to let you know that if you are bullied or treated very unfairly, it's not your fault. So do not hate yourself. Never hate your core. Keep on loving yourself. Keep on loving your soul. 
as long as you love yourself, you love your soul, you have love inside of you, you can share your love and kindness to help other people. You can spread love and kindness to the world. The first physical activity today is in order to spread love and kindness, we'll create greeting cards. Do you have bamboo brush in your to-go kit bag? Please take the bamboo brush out from the to-go bag. Good. This one is called Fude. Fude. Fude in Japanese. Fude is not just a brush pen, not just a art pen. This is extension of your soul. You can express your soul through this fude. So please relax your whole body, relax your mind, relax your soul, and please write big circle in the air. I will use big fude and you can see easily. Relax body, relax shoulder, relax mind, so, and write big circle in the air. So good. One more time. So good. Now, please write horizontal line from left to right. Su, su. Now, vertical line, top to bottom. Su, su. Very good. Now, please get and copy paper from the kit bag. And I recommend before using ink, put craft paper like this, like craft paper or newspaper or flyer on the table. And you don't mess up the table you can keep the table clean. Good. Are you ready? Now put a little ink to fude. A little means you don't have to dip. It's hard to, I'm gonna use a little bigger. Well, you can see it. You don't have to dip whole brush in the ink, around one third, around only one third dip in the ink. Are you ready? And hold around in the middle, like holding a pencil, okay? Not like this, not like that, around the middle part, like holding the pencil and light circle, su, su, good. As long as you relax your body, arm, you don't do like this, right? 
so do not use list work very much and do not lean like this. Upright, use whole arm. That is good. And now, horizontal line. Left to right. Su. Su. Good. Now, vertical line. From top to bottom. Su. Su. Very good. Now put the pen on the table nicely. Before writing Japanese letter, I will explain a little bit the very basic of Japanese letters. In Japan, there are three kinds of letters. Kanji. Kanji. Hiragana, Hiragana, Katakana, Katakana. Kanji was created in China around 4,500 years ago, long time ago, and imported to Japan around 1,500 years ago. After that, Japanese people invented their own alphabet, hiragana and katakana. Mostly, kanji and hiragana are used to write sentences. Katakana is used to write words, vocabulary, from foreign countries. For example, when Japanese people write table, chair, hamburger, America, France, they will use katakana. Easy to write? Good. Today's first hiragana. First hiragana mean today you will write one kanji and two hiragana. Hiragana is easier, less stroke, so we go hiragana first. The first hiragana today is a pronunciation of this hiragana is I will show you the stroke order. One, two, three. Hmm? One more time. One, two, three. Okay, now. Please practice in your copy paper. Twice. Please practice in your copy paper. Twice. One, two, three. One, two, three. Very good. Next hiragana. Pronunciation is I. I. Only two stroke. One, two. One, two. Please practice twice in your copy paper. One, one, two. Very good. 
Let's combine two hiraganas. You remember the pronunciation? The first hiragana. A. Second hiragana. I. A. I. I. I means love. I means love in Japanese. Now please get the greeting card. You have a blank greeting card in the to go back. You find it? Good. Please write I in the left side. You can notice that. Left side of greeting card. All you have to think is balance. Greeting card is small. And you will write two letters. Okay? As long as you think the balance, you don't run out the space. I will hold. Big sample for you. Okay, are you ready? So please write in the greeting card, left side. One, two, three. One, two. Good job. Good. Now put Fude on the table and put greeting card on the table because you have to go back to the copy paper. The last letter today is kanji. Pronunciation is I. The same. And meaning is same, love. First, I will show you the stroke order. Starting stroke. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So please practice twice in your copy paper. I will hold the sample for you. Let's practice together in the copy paper. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. One more practice in the copy paper. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Very good. Now you'll go back to the greeting card and write kanji I in the right side. Greeting card is smaller than copy paper. And this kanji requires 13 strokes. So all you have to think is balance, harmony. Okay, I will hold bigger sample for you. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Very good. After ink is dry, you can decorate the other side as you like. You can attach like origami, origami like this. You can attach origami like this. Or if you like drawing manga, you can draw manga art here. I like Hello Kitty and Pikachu. I draw this one. If you like Pikachu or Hello Kitty, you can draw Pikachu Hello Kitty on the back side. Okay. Then when you finish creating greeting card, please send out with your love and kindness with love and kindness that's all for today thank you for attending my creative zen session またお会いできる日を楽しみにしていますそれでは皆さんさようなら